The other day I was on TikTok and found a bunch of epic kitchen gadgets. <gasps> Most of the time I think kitchen gadgets are stupid, but um today I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to go into this video with an open mind. Vegetable freshener packets, air fryer, avocado cutter, chewing gum holder, popcorn basket, instant pot, strawberry strainer, rice cooker. The first kitchen gadget I found is Hamilton Beach Breakfast Sandwich Maker with Egg Cocoa Green, Customized Ingredients, Perfect for English Muffins, Croissants, Mini Waffles, Single Silver. They tried to get every single keyword into that title. Well, they make it look good with those photos. Mm. Wait, so you can put it in the dishwasher? Oh, that makes it so much easier. You can just remove it out of the little gadget. You don't have to clean it yourself by hand. It has 28,000 reviews and it has like a four and a half, so I expect greatness from this actually. I wanted a sandwich, instead I got a nightmare. It's like, I swear some people wanna blame their whole life on this product. It's like, this isn't responsible for like your divorce and everything. Let's just see if we have a nightmare when That's we true. go to the kitchen. Hip, 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 hip. This looks like something that would be in an old dino. An old dino. I don't know, it seems like it might be more complicated than just doing it the old fashioned way. <laughs> but I'm ready to be shocked. Ah. Oh. One more time. Just because I'm lazy, I'm gonna watch a video on it. Instead of reading the instructions. Yeah. Ooh, look at that. Isn't that magical? It's green, so that means it's done. Uh, I, I think I'm just, yeah, it's done. It smells like plastic in the air, so you know. I know, that's how you know, like, this is gonna be some good plastic food, you know? Yeah, literally. It looks shitty, but that's fine. We don't have sliced cheese, so we're gonna be using Mexican-style classic shredded cheese. Did that look good and stuff? Oh, it smells like really, um, like this is gonna kill you. But that is fine. hot. Ooh. <sighs> can I already hear it kind of sizzling? So for the bottom compartment, you just put cheese. And then you can also put like ham and stuff, but I don't have any of that. Now the next compartment, you put the egg. Wait, do you spray it? She didn't, did she? She does not spray it. Yeah, cause like, maybe I'll see if it's not steak. <laughs> oh yeah. No, this is so thin, but let's just... Now she said four minutes. So yeah, at 12.40, we'll take it out. Uh, it actually sounds like too much work, so I don't want to. No, I definitely wouldn't want that. The president doesn't even have any power. They're just a little puppet. It's all fake. Oh my gosh, QAnon confirmed. <laughs> oh, oh my yeah. God, the green light just turned off. Does that mean anything? Uh... That's the thing, like, I don't know if it means anything. But yeah, like Lucas said earlier, it isn't even how to make an egg, egg sandwich. Like, I don't find it difficult at all. So is this needed? Kinda. Not really, though. It's 12.40, so it should be done now. Well, should I unplug it? I think you just open it, right? Okay. Oh, you can tell that's cooked. Wipe this so the <gasps> egg now I get why there's that little thing. I didn't get it at first, but there was that slab. Oh. I'm just gonna unplug it so I don't burn myself alive. Oh, and there you have it. <gasps> okay, they did make it easy, I have to admit. It's like a wall, that's a McDonald's sandwich right there. Okay, I do have to admit it, I understand. This is, this is my thought process right now. I like the machine because it feels like I'm eating at a restaurant. There's always that one thing in your head. If whatever you make food, it's never as good as if someone else made it, and it feels like someone else made it for me. Yeah, literally, the robot made it. It tastes the same though. If I'm, I was expecting it to taste like butter. Better than McDonald's? No, like butter than if I made it just on the stove. Oh top. yeah. Can you imagine all the stress if you had the pans going, the toaster, like. That's the question. Is it more stressful? I don't think it is. 
Next, we have a Savoy Chef Sandwich Cutter and Sealer Decruster Sandwich Maker Cut and Seal. Great for lunchbox and bento box. Boys and girls, kids lunch. Sandwich cutters for kids. When I first saw this, I was honestly like, wait, I literally don't get it. But then I realized the whole point of it is just Ha having an at-home Uncrustable because kids are annoying as fuck and only eat stuff without crust on it. So this is just a making it at home. I never have understood Uncrustables. Bitch, they're still crust. I am so happy this is what this product was because when you first told me about it, I literally thought it was a product for buying an Uncrustable and then using a thing to cut off the edges of an Uncrustable. That's what I thought it oh, was. Wait, that's what you thought? That's what, that's what I was like, this is so dumb. But then this at least, you know, at least you're gonna make your own Uncrustable. So this one has 9,000 reviews and it also has like a full and a half stars. Wow, I bought like the best products on Amazon. Oh, 20 cents for 70 cents. Okay. So you do save money in the long run by buy, by using this. I mean, it depends if you want the organic strawberry jellies and stuff. They're just assuming I don't want the organic free-raised oh, strawberries. Oh, that's true. What kind of jam and peanut butter are they using They in probably this? bought the ones out in like the sewer in New York, you know? Literally. I mean, I have no fucking clue, but... I am excited to try it out, so I'm gonna hip hip upstairs. Hip 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 hip. I do have to say I love the packaging. It's so bright. You can tell it's mutt for kids. Bewitched. That used to be a show. Oh. So this is supposed to come with, oh wait, full straight. It has a little game? You know I'm a sucker for games. I got a little bonus item. What do you call a cow with no legs? <laughs> There's a one. Okay, well, let me think. A milk? Ground beef. Oh, that's good. Why did the mushroom get invited to all the parties? Because he's a fun guy? Oh, yeah. I've heard that before. Oh my god, you know these. Let's see how many I can do. I want to do an album. Why shouldn't you tell a secret on a farm? Okay, let me really think. <laughs> a pig? Potatoes have eyes and corn ha have ears. I thought it was fun and I like that it's free. I actually felt like it was so effing dumb and I was just pissed because I didn't even order that. I only want what I want and stop trying to add different stuff to my family. Although I did like the game, I think I'm gonna have to throw it away. Yep. Now this comes with three types of like bread cuddles. Like when they literally have the directions in photos on the side, that's when you know it's gonna be a good product. Like not too complicated, you know? Yeah, cause I don't like thinking, you know? Yeah. How do you think about enough stuff on the day? I'm gonna have to make three peanut butter and jellies cause I'm gonna test every single one. Like all the different shapes and sizes? <laughs> yeah. I know everyone's wondering what's in this plastic bag. It's um, Smuckle's jelly. I put it in a plastic bag because it's so fucking sticky. Now you know. Any other questions? Doesn't look like it. So I'll continue. If you grew up having peanut butter and jellies, you should make a peanut butter and jelly right now. It feels like I'm like connecting with my, what do they call it in like yoga and stuff? Inner child. Yeah, my inner child. Now you might be wondering, Lucas, why do you say one piece of bread. I hate it because I can tell you want to make a peanut butter and jelly, but you can make one. Oh my god. I know. What I noticed making yours um, is you just, I know they aren't gonna live up to Uncrustables because you need to have a lot of peanut butter. Like they aren't just putting a little tiny layer for these, like they're, like you have to put like a big, you know what I mean? And then just like kind of focus on the middle. But I feel like that's cheating. I don't is, know why, <laughs> why I do. The rest is going straight in the trash. <laughs> kind of wasted stuff. I know. <laughs> but you know, like, the makers of this claim, like, oh my god, for the outside of the bread, you, there's so many things you could do and, like, recycle it. It's like, bitch, everyone's throwing it away. <laughs> I promise you that. Put that in the middle last cell. Are you ready? Oh, okay, that was cool. Rip off the little edge. No one wants that shit. Touching you, sweet kid. Okay, this is thick. See what I mean? I kind of kind of see how this looks compared to this. Yeah. Sweet Caroline. Okay, let me think. 
I'm not even kidding. Like, this one feels so much better. Like, it looks just... identical, too. Sweet Caroline. Okay, this is my homemade one. 2.9 ounces. Doorbot. Oh! These bitches tried it, and it's more expensive. We're gonna try making this square one. This one's probably the best for least amount of waste. That's true. You're getting the whole. You put this on the bottom? Yeah, that's what I did. How do you know you're doing it right now? I know, I just pushed it and then eventually you get it. Oh, isn't it so satisfying? Oh my gosh. Ooh! That is cute. Two little peanut butter parties. Oh. And then they fall in love and had five kids. Now let's try this squail, even though we already know what it's gonna do, you know? Oh, but, yeah. But you know, I still wanna try it. So for this squail one, they have two. If you wanna waste more blood, or if you wanna waste a little blood. And of course I'm gonna choose the wasting more blood, you know? Oh yeah. Cause if you're gonna do it, do it. <laughs> Fuck. It can be stressful, by the way, you know? But you just breathe through it and it will figure, you'll figure it out. Your inner child will know well. But then it's like, wait, what? Wait, is it actually not working? Wait, is this not gonna flop? No, I did it wrong! You're supposed to do this! Well, now you have all three going at once. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't know. So I... this does show that like it can get complicated though. Yeah, but like, I, I, I still think that if you wanted to do it, you would like, you But know. like, we really like, we like our trying and it still didn't work. That's true. So, like this can be a little bit complicated. Now is the true test of which is butter. Oh, I'm... I'll try the nugget, the uncrustable, and you'll try the homemade first. Oh. This is still frozen. This is honestly like really good. I, peanut butter and jelly, it is so good. Holy shit. Okay, so my inside is a little bit filled, but yours is gooey. Oh. Just look with that. That's what mama and papa want. That honestly is really good. I mean, they're both bops. I do like mine more though, just because it's more filled, but might be too much for some people. <laughs> I was gonna say I like the Unquestionable more. This is the only reason though, because I grew up on it, so it's like more iconic in my mind. Oh yeah, but then Nostalgic, look at this. I guess. Some parts only have peanut butter. Whereas mine, I, was like, I equally distributed mine. That's what's sad. That gadget was cool. It met my expectations. Yeah, actually it's kind of cute and fun. What does cute and fun mean to you? Keep on. Get a dictionary, boo boo. Now we have a mini bag sale, heat sale, kitchen gadgets, food sale, re bag, re sale for food storage, handheld heat sale for chips bag, foil bag, Milo bags, color sheets, nail strips with storage case mitt. So basically, this is a glamorized hair straightener. You, you could, could do this with a hair straightener. Oh, yeah, I saw someone on TikTok do that. Oh, you, so. They made like um popsicles, you know, like those popsicles that are in the plastic thing? Yeah. But then they just like sealed it with a straightener. And it doesn't start a fire or anything? No, it like burned a little bit, but then it just sealed. Oh. This goes in the category of just weird ad, but I love it. This is the first kitchen gadget we're testing where it's like, it's a cooling island, but in your kitchen, and it looks like a cooling island, but it's not what? So the main purpose is to reseal bags, right? Chip bags, yeah, something like that. Why do they show french fries? What's the, what the fuck does that got to do with it? Mm -hmm. You can't reseal an effing McDonald's french fry carton. But I'm trying to think, just honestly, genuinely think in my life, when would I have needed this? Like, when do I ever think I have to reseal a bag of, of chips? Like, I'm trying to think. Oh, I just was thinking like, you don't need it, but instead of using a chip clip, you can do this and- Oh, you would do this each time? That's fucking funny. Each time you're done eating the bag of chips. <laughs> That's honestly what I was thinking in my honestly, head. Honestly, yeah, it would, it would keep it fresh longer. And it would be good for prank. So you open a bag of chips, put poop in it and seal it back up and people oh, yeah. think that it came like that from the store. Oh yeah, put it back at the gas station. That'd be so funny. <laughs> this has 4,600 ratings and also has four and a half stars. Wow, I really did get the best things. And you always got the Amazon's choice. Yeah, Jeff oh, Bezos Jeff. control me. Oh, Jeff Bezos, dick sucker. I know a little bottom for him, boy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's try this out because I actually am creamy. Hip, 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 hip. Oh. Really simple packaging.
exactly how it was in the pictures. No, um, catfishing. Neve, you don't have to come over. <laughs> okay. Especially like immediately it starts the fire. Oh. Let me do it one more time. So, so like, just to test it, will it start a fire, you know? Oh yeah. But this time will it start a fire. Oh, it didn't. So it has this little button in the inside. I should probably figure out what that means. So I think it's turn it on. Yeah, it is. <laughs> It's already getting hot. How does this work? Like, how do products get hot after literally a second? It kind of makes know. me think like, I literally know nothing. We have some bags of chips. You can try it. Just, just get your house like, <laughs> if it starts to fire, like, I'm a But you want to do that one first? No, um, you can do the chip bags first. Oh, okay. Oh, well, um, I think you should fold it over though. So it like fully reseals, right? Oh, I thought it would reseal like where it, it was sealed. Oh, okay, then just, just do whatever your heart thinks. And this is what my heart thinks. Yeah. I mean, that worked. The only problem with a bag like this is like, you know what I mean? I oh. can't like just do it all the way across. No, I think this is how you make it easy. You just slide across, you know? But you might have to like perfectly have it straight. If how would I sense. slide though? Wait, well, yeah, like I wanna see if my idea works. Oh, right. To make it more efficient, I wanna see if this works, but maybe it won't. I was thinking you could like slide across the whole entire thing. Oh, I get what you mean. But I don't know if this is gonna work. Part of me thinks that's too thick. Why am I like licking my lips while I'm doing this? I'm like <laughs> living. This is so much easier than just putting like a clip on it. <laughs> no, it isn't. <laughs> Does it not open now, right? Damn, that oh, works, this honey. Let me do this part. I mean, Lucas's way was just as efficient as mine. Mine took just as long. Test, is it sealed? It literally is. Oh, that's fucking cool. Then you can bring it on a road trip now. You know what I mean? Then don't have to worry about spilling all over the back seat. Wait, like if I cut my arm, would it seal it? Literally. Probably. Try it. Nah. For this one, I'm gonna try to get it perfect. Like it's like we we never bought it. Oh, so like this is the test of like, could you do a shit in bag? Oh, yeah, that's what I want to do. So far, so good. You know, this is the problem in the middle. You know. Yeah. We can still get it. Don't give up. <laughs> You might be able to like sell this to a neighbor and pretend it's, it's new. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing's coming out, sis, it's sealed. Now that is cool, let's see. Oh, I missed a little bit in the middle, but still like, that is pretty cool, you gotta admit. Now try this. And <laughs> yeah, this is the scariest part, because for some reason I do have the vibe that this is like smoke inducing or something. Should we not do it? Because maybe it's not even meant for stuff like this. Eh, but they never clarified that. That's true. Why am I actually scared? Jacob! Ah! <laughs> that wasn't even a joke, guys. I'm just a little kid. It did leave a stain, so I'm assuming that isn't good. Oh, yeah, okay, that's... yeah. But... <laughs> Would you ever do It that? worked! <laughs> this is also good for our road trip. You literally just bought it, I think. So it gets not even- But it is it is sealed though. That's true. Is that how they do breast implants? Have you ever seen those plastic surgery shows where they burn the inside of the skin? It's like it doesn't oh. bleed or something like that. Kind of the same thing. Interesting. Can I try in Luna's hair with it? No. Why? That's not animal abuse. <laughs> This works. And also like it actually was easy. I would never buy one and I wouldn't recommend anybody to buy it, but if you did have one, it would be nice for road trips. Yeah, that's the thing is that I could never picture myself using it, but I love the product, so I would still put it on my um, Amazon Affiliate page? Yeah, Can exactly. you do one for this video? Should I? Oh yeah, links below. Links below, guys. I make a small commission. Yep. How am I supposed to breathe with no air? No air, yeah, yeah. How am I supposed to breathe with no air? No air, yeah, yeah. Next, we have Kitchen Gizmo Snap and Strain Pot Strainer and Pasta Strainer Adjustable Silicone Clip on Strainer for Pots, Pans, and Bowls. Great. I wasn't planning on getting this, but on so many websites, TikToks, whatever the f else I looked at, they kept saying this. It just didn't even look that cool to me because I was thinking, just use a strainer, dumbass bitch. But then I was like, I guess 
I get it, and I haven't even tried it, so I don't know. Yeah, I never understood how difficult people find straining pasta, because there's so many life hacks for this. As you've seen the one where you, you literally put an actual strainer on the, you connect it to your bowl and do this, and it looks so dangerous, like all this, like hot water's gonna hit your arms. Is it because so many people have heard horror stories about boiling water killing people? Like, is that why it does that have nothing to do with it? Because even the fact that like in these new houses, above the stove, there's a faucet. People like don't even like filling it up in this sink and carrying it to the stove. Like, I just know for a fact I would never use this. Cause I, this is my fear. You start pouring it, some noodles are gonna fall out. And then you have your waste. Now you can't eat those noodles. Don't you just know for a fact those noodles are gonna fall out? I mean, we haven't tried it out. Let's see them. Oh, so they also say this is for like veggies and fruit and pasta and stuff. Cool. I don't like washing them out. This is also Amazon's choice. I literally am. Jeff Bezos' sex object today. You're just a vapid whore. Yep, I do YouTube, but that makes me more of a whore because I want attention. All I am is a slut. Okay. Um, should we try this out then? Hip, 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 hip. Hip, 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 hip. It says the ultimate pot strainer in quotations. That's honestly... <laughs> So funny because you could put anything in quotations. Like I could make a product. Let's say it's why why is like the only thing that come to mind is like a sex robot or something. A sex robot? Make... What? A sex robot or something. I guess an ultimate sex robot. Oh yeah, like then then the quotations I'd say like best sexual experience ever. No one has said that, but s s who cares? I said it. Oh yeah, as long as one person says it, you're allowed to put it in quotations. Don't. <laughs> okay, well, it's not fun to any size. That's the thing, is that we're kind of doing a big test right now is because every photo, it shows a big pot. We're gonna test it on a small pot because it did say adjustable, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Just get ready to put your thinking cups on. Anxiety is gonna rise, but just breathe. <laughs> Today we're cooking ramen. Did I already say that? Yeah. Oh. Uh, we well, actually don't know if you did. Oh. You told me the behind the scenes. Let us know if you want us to do a Patreon for behind the scenes stuff. Oh yeah. Now we just wait for this to boil, I guess. Simple, all it is is the product. No instructions. And it is adjustable. From the photos, I didn't think it would be this, um, adjust, like, silicone-y. You know what I mean? So, like, let's just test it right now. Like, yeah. But the question now that I'm thinking is, if this was a big pot, I think noodles... Let's just see right now. Uh-oh. <laughs> big pot. See, it's just a little bit too small. Let's all just admit it. These bananas are pasta. Let's just see. He knows I'm gonna fall over. Like, that's adding more stress to your life, in my opinion. Oh, mom, when like so many people at the house, like literally 20 people, she has this big ass pull of pasta and this wouldn't work for that. Yeah. But I mean, maybe I'm just being nitpicky. You don't? The ramen is done. So funny what we talk about when this is cooking. Like, like, like I'm, a, like I'm, a, I'm, we just are saying, like, you can literally do anything. And it's just so <laughs> funny that, like, this is what we talk about, guys. We have behind the scenes. <laughs> It did work. Wow. That like literally worked perfectly actually. And you even had it on kind of an annoying part of the pan. Like next time you probably put it on the side, you know? But, like that actually, that popped off. I know this is perfect for like, um, most cooking pastas. Like I said earlier, if you had a big pot, do you agree with me? It probably won't work. Oh yeah, this is more for like, you know, college duty. Or just like, if you have three people in your household or something. Gen Z. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna put a Gen Z people. Mm -hmm. I mean, now the question lies, is in, it's in front of me, the question. This or a strainer? This is easy as F, so this costs the same as a strainer, I'm pretty sure. How much was it? Like, I don't know. But like, it's the same as a strainer. Yeah, I would um message them back and I'd see how it follows up from there. Do you want to keep it, Lucas? Like, this is the real question. Nah, you can have it.
So you the you think it's shit basically. I just already have so many gizmos and gadgets, I don't need any more. I got gizmos and gadgets galore. Ha Worth Sushi Maker Roller Equipment Perfect Roll Sushi Maker DIY Easy Kitchen Magic Gadget Kitchen Accessories dot dot dot. This one isn't Amazon's choice, so I'm not a Jeff Bezos whore. Also, this is a lot more indie. Only 290 reviews. You know me, I'm always trying to find stuff that, trying to promote local brands and stuff. Even though I just use the Hamilton thing, but that's fine. Having a sushi roll maker at home, that does sound good. Yeah, I have watched videos on how to make sushi at home. Usually, I think people use like this wooden thing. I don't oh, know what it's called. Yeah. But this is supposedly an easier way to make sushi. This one actually is the worst reviewed so thus far. It's three and a half stars. That's fine. Oh, it says use for any rolled food, not just sushi. So you could be making um pinwheels. Oh, that tortilla thing. The Midwest version of sushi. <laughs> that, that's actually what that is. <laughs> Let's see if we live. Yip, yip, yip. Yippee yay, yippee yay, yippee yay. Hello. We have the gadget right here. This box is really giving, um, Windows. Do you get what I'm saying? It's giving Windows 2008. Very beginner graphic design. Yeah, but um, that wasn't hate, it was just me expressing my opinion. Oh yeah, also the graphic design doesn't like, doesn't reflect the product, so yeah. yeah. So this one, I honestly don't even really get how it works. I think it just, it just somehow works. <laughs> 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 don't even speak. It comes with something. Happy day. You can send a card to someone? They give you a little card. Oh my God, it's spread envelope. joy. <gasps> Okay, and then a thank you for your porches. Okay. Thank you for that. I take back what I said about the graphic design. Wait, why do the photos look like that? Yeah, um. <laughs> the photos like didn't print out all the way. A lot of this is giving like made in your basement, but that's fine. So we have some cooked sticky white rice, which this is what they use for sushi, right? Oh yeah, sticky rice, I think. Now, I have something really sad today to say. I was telling Lucas when we were walking upstairs. So yesterday I went on the Wama app to prepare for this video. I was living in the moment, but I was thinking ahead. <laughs> and it said that they had noli sheets in stock. Those big sheets of seaweed for sushi. And I went today, just assuming some bitch didn't buy all of them, you know? But it turns out some bitch who did buy all of them. So all I can find is seaweed sheets and I'm just gonna hope for the best. I'm gonna pray for the best. I think if I keep looking above, it will work. What is gonna be making avocado rolls today? The most basic ass roll. Avocado king. Fucking bitch. I think we have to let this cool down. Oh yeah, that's, that's hot. Should we put it in the fridge? <laughs> oh yeah. The best way to get it done quick. Fun. Wait. Cop an avocado using the avocado gadget? Oh my, I had two gadgets on one. Oh my gosh. But to be completely honest, you got me that for a video and I, I never use it. Cause I, I noticed that using a knife is easier. For real? Yeah. Oh, so if anyone watched that video, that's Lucas's review now. Yeah, long-term review. Eight months later. I think you literally just put the... Can we switch positions? Like, you try to figure it out. Wait, what? Because I think you literally, yeah, you put it in here. No, well, that can't be right. What? And then what? Oh, and then you go like that. And then once there's stuff in there, you actually would do that. And then it's done. Ooh. You just go like this. You solved it. You should try it since like, <laughs> you fully solved that shit. How's this gonna work though? <laughs> it's way too small. I'll try it. I'm just gonna use my hands since I'm not working at a restaurant. Sometimes when I'm editing my videos, I wonder why I say 
random stuff. Like, why did I even have to say, because I'm not working on a restaurant? Like, that's not really needed, because none of you guys assumed I was solving this to a restaurant. I'm always on the defensive. Add some... Okay, I'm actually just gonna do this out of the machine right now. From videos that I've watched just throughout my life, I'm pretty sure you just put a layer of rice. Yeah, it's kind of thin. By the way, um, is this a thing? I'm I'm obviously not the one to invent this, but mini sushi that you do, you you, you literally purposely use these sushi snacks. Well, that would be cute. Use a bit, little bit of this avocado. Disgusting. How Remember, much peel the it. avocado. Guacamole. <laughs> Such a funny thing. So funny. Put it in there. Oh no. no! I don't know if I believe in this. I'm kind of just. I mean, let like, me try it again, but put way less shit in. Well, yeah, that's already. You can't even fold that. Is it good though? It is good. I'm gonna try it without avocado because I think it adds too much. This rice really is sticky. Just like me. I know I'm being annoying, but like when you were holding it just then, I'm like, it'd be so much easier for you to just roll it in your hands. But okay. <laughs> I think it's gonna work. Wait, they really did something. Wait! That's so cute! <laughs> Wait, and then and then to make it actually like sushi, you'd cut it? I mean, we don't have noi, but I'm pretty sure it would work with noi. There's a little bit um missing is because we're using these little seaweed snacks. You try it out, Lucas, and let's see if anyone can use it, because I'm type A and you're type B. I don't even know what that means, but it might be a little too much. Hmm? Don't try to step in. <laughs> Okay. Oh, good enough. Oh! You're right, I actually does taste like sushi. The sushi maker is gonna be classified as Employee of the month. If I did have a noi, it would even be butter. You could add like tuna or salmon inside of it. I'll wish it, but I, we can only do mini ones, but I liked it. Yeah, I really enjoyed it. You did? Mm-hmm. There's a little bit of sea seaweed in your mouth. That's how much you enjoyed it. Where? See, here? Yeah. Those are the five kitchen gadgets we tested today in honor of Crazy Russian Hot Girl. Put in the comments what else we were testing, what else we should test out. Bye! Peace out.